today's video. We're gonna try X-Pot. Um, it's highly recommended. So let's see if it's any good. So the yin yang, yeah. we've been serving it with far gloss, and it's usually served with uni like that. Oh, okay. And the bluefin tuna with caviar. Awesome. Perfect. Enjoy. Thank you so much. So, okay, so first, first thing is we're going to try the simple thing is the salad. You can't mess up on the salad, so let's go with the salad. The Very good salad. Has a lot of zing to it. Perfect salad. Perfect. This is a perfect salad. You can't, like, I mean, I can't say that enough. Perfect salad. Let's try this. So this is a this is wagyu. Very melty, melt in your mouth. Oh man, that's good. I like that a lot. I like that a lot. Um, that one was mine, this one was yours. That's <laughs> it. So this is what it looks like. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Totally worth it. Melt in mouth, perfect. Mm. The, uh, the black swan. Hey, want to try the black swan? Mm. Mm. So inside, you got some some meat inside of it and some gravy. Cooked cook very good. This is great. Very good. Wonderful. Mm. Everything on this one was completely edible and it was good, very good. It had a very subtle taste to it. Um, the beef, yeah, the, uh, um, she's saying that it has duck meat in it. Um, you really can't taste the duck too much, but very good.
Oh yeah, go ahead. Oh yeah, I'm ready. Go ahead. Mm -hmm. Oh man. Bye bye bear. <laughs> He's so cute. There he goes. There he goes. Oh, there he goes. <laughs> So it looks like the bear is pretty much almost melted down. My, my, my son had a, had a breakdown because the bear was being melted away. Poor guy. Um, but it looks like uh, we have a lot of spices in here. And uh, I thought I saw a quail egg somewhere. But uh, yeah. Yeah, that's the, sea, that's the spicy side. And then the other one was a lobster. And this is the, uh, the lobster broth over here. Yep, and yep, there's your lobster. So there are lobster in here. Yep, there it is. So this is the lobster sauce, or I'm sorry, lobster broth. And then this is the uh, the spicy broth in this side. So it does come with a cookie bear. Sorry bear, the bear is gone. Oh, and you got some, some, some blood. Uh, All right, let's taste some of this uh, broth. Let's try the lobster broth first. Oh yeah, that's, man, that's a strong lobster flavor. No, oh, it's really good. Um, it's also like a, almost like a lobster buttery uh, broth, it's like a bisque, um, really good. Mm. Oh yeah, really good. All right, and we're gonna try the, the spicy broth. Wife says it's super spicy, so let's see what it tastes like. Oh, that's really good. Really good, really good. Um, it is spicy, not super spicy. Um, I think I prefer this over the lobster broth, but we got the lobster broth because we got my son here and he can't handle spice. But definitely get um, the spicy broth if you do like spicy. Um, it is um, um, a little, a little, a little um, salty. It's and um, spicy, but definitely good. This is it right here. This is the one again. Okay. the wagyu ribeye cap, wagyu truffle, then wagyu roasted. Everything ten seconds. Oh, perfect. We also have our vermicelli white rice noodles. I have the spicy beef skewers here. Uh, pork meatballs and the wagyu dumplings. Oh, awesome. Thank you so much. No worries. I'll send you a tray that's a little larger than this one. Sure. What did you say this one? That's the, uh, the wide uh, vermicelli noodle. The wide vermicelli noodle. Oh. This is the uh, wide vermicelli noodle. Um, T, what is this one? Lamb. Okay, this is spicy. the lamb. And then this no, is the what? I don't know. That's the spicy your hot pot ingredients as well. Oh, perfect. Your uh, bamboo shoot, okay. your vegetable combo. Okay. So both of these two for one minute. Okay. And then over here, shrimp paste fungus with fish paste. Oh, two awesome. to three minutes. Awesome. Yeah. Shrimp paste. All right, this is the uh, the shrimp paste, uh, the bamboo shoots, and uh, we got the vegetables right here. Oh, this is, I'm sorry, this is the uh, the meatballs. Um, what is this one? Wagyu dumplings. Wagyu dumplings and the uh, spicy skewers. You put the thing here. some seafood combo for you guys. Oh, oh awesome. Oh, Thank you so much. Combo. Oh my god, everything is here. Okay. Perfect. Thanks. All right, man. So so much food is here. Let's try the. Um, let's try the meatball. Gold ladle. Yeah, and the other one. Second gold ladle. Try the meatball, and we're gonna try the, the dumpling. Put 
Try this one. Here. Yeah, you try it. Okay. All right, so we're gonna we're gonna try the um, the uh, the dumplings. Put in some sauce. Mm -hmm. Wow, that is a very good dumpling. Mm. That's a very good dumpling. The um. The outside casing isn't too thick, so you can taste it, but it doesn't take away from the actual dumpling flavor of itself. Oh man, very good. Make sure you get that. Very good. And next one we got the um, the pork meatballs. Again, we're gonna put in the sauce. Man, their sauce here is very Did you good. You the experience over here? Oh, it's, oh, it's awesome. awesome. Perfect. Thank, Thank you. you. Here's the food combo there for us as well. Too long, but we're gonna try it out. There's some lobster right here. Put in some sauce. Have you tried your sauce yet? Am I the lesson in there too long, but the flavor is still good. 
I should have taken that a little bit early as soon as the as soon as the broth started getting warm so it's not overcooked. So that's what I recommend. If you guys get that, make sure you get the lobsters out first so that way you can eat it. That's still good flavor. Try this. Oh, it's this, yeah, the, the shrimp paste. This is the shrimp paste. Oh, yeah, the shrimp paste. Yeah. So we're just going to take this right here, the shrimp paste. Shrimp paste. No, the spoon. Alright, so let's try this right here. The spoon fell. Alright, let's try the, uh, the, sh the shrimp paste. Wait. Mm. That one there's got a very unique flavor. I um, can't it's almost it. like a spongy, but man, very good, very unique. You can get it. No, get it for me. All right, we got the shrimp paste. Mm. Very light, very fluffy. Man. Everything is super good here. Everything is super delicious. I gave my wife a little bit of shrimp paste. See if she likes it. Wife likes it too. Alright, so I tried this in the lobster. Let's try it. Better in the spicy sauce, but again, that like unique texture, very good. Get eaten the Throw more shrimp paste in. Mm -hmm. oh, do you want it in the regular or here? Uh,
surviving over here? Is it okay? Oh, oh we're trying. So this is the... Um, Those are the uh, New Haven oysters. Okay. Virginia. Oh, okay. Virginia. Awesome. And then this is the... Chilean sea bass. Awesome. Okay. And we have the Boston lobster and tiger shrimp. Oh, perfect. And then each one is what, about 30 seconds? Or about 30 to 45 seconds. And then the, the lobster and the shrimp about a minute to two. Okay, perfect. And then these are... Those are ready to go. Where do they go? We're gonna, we're gonna try the oysters. Let's try the oysters. <laughs> very fresh flavor. We have definitely no ocean very, taste. Very fresh flavor. Man, it doesn't taste like the ocean. It doesn't have a weird aftertaste. Man, very smooth. This one's good. Try this, the Chilean sea bass. You want to try the sea bass? Sea? <laughs> All right, so let's try the Chilean sea bass. Very fresh fish. Very fresh. No, no fishy flavor. Oh, this is very good. This is very good. Mm. Yeah, it's good lobster. Can you have um, the bamboo shoot in some? Yep. Thank you. Oh, look at the bamboo shoots. Huge sheets of bamboo shoots. Spicy seasoning, way better than the lobster in the lobster fist. Right All right, this is the uh, the bamboo shoots. We're gonna try the bamboo shoots. Let's try. Mm. Oh man, never had huge bamboo shoots like these. But I must recommend, man. Never thought about this. This is actually really good. Really good. Mm-hmm. I like that a lot. I never had them before. Man, very good. the um, spicy beef skewers we're gonna put one in the spicy seasoning and we're gonna take the other one and we're gonna put it in the lobster seasoning or lobster broth more bamboo shoots this is really good Try the beef skewer. Oh, I 
All right, let's try the uh, the beef skewers. We're gonna pull them out. We're gonna dip it in some sauce. Daddy's gonna get a beef. All right, let's try let's try these beef skewers. Why you eat them? Mm. Okay, yeah, you can get it. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Mm. Melts in your mouth. The flavor is so good. Mm. Make sure you get this too. Oh my goodness. This is a home run guys, home run. This is again the, um, the beef skewers. Man, these are amazing. Ooh, beef skewers are smoking mm. so good. Definitely enjoying this. Mm. Here, Ethan, try this. He's done. He's done. I tried the beef skewer that came out of the, um, the, the lobster. Lobster broth. Let's, let's try this. Mm. How we feel it over here? Mm. Oh yes, I'm sorry. Very good. So I'm, I prefer them in the spicy seasoning, but even the lobster broth is still pretty good. Mm. Good. I think this is one of my favorites. One of my favorites. I think we can go with that fried rice. I think. Go with the fried rice? Yeah, we gotta get that one. That's perfect. Oh, it's an egg. So, this is the uh, truffle. This is the truffle fried rice. So, we got the truffle right here. And it looks like the fried rice is actually underneath this egg dome right here. So, let's break into it. Oh yep, yeah, there it is. There it is. So let's try. Oh look, it's got it's got gold flakes in it. If you can see that, it's got it does got the gold flakes in it too. Let's try the truffle egg fried rice. Here, babe. Let's give the uh, the fried rice a try. Here we go. Oh, we got bits of gold in it too. So we try it out with the gold. See if the gold tastes any good. Oh man. Oh man. Oh man. Oh man. I'm gonna keep saying this, but man, that is the best fried rice I've ever had. Yeah. I can totally taste the truffle. The gold adds no flavor. There's no flavor for gold. But man, I can tell you that that right there is a, a mean fried rice. It is awesome. It is awesome. Definitely make sure you get that. My gosh, that's like an amazing fried rice. Oh look, there's seasoning on top. You're supposed to put a little bit of seasoning. If you want to add some heat. This is the best fried rice I've ever had. Oh my gosh. If, if I didn't get anything on this menu and I just got this fried rice, I would be a happy person.
ready? Yeah. So one, two, and three. Ooh, look at that. Oh man, it's awesome. We got some dessert. Man, look at look at this. It's like a like a floating <laughs> island of wonderful dessert. Oh, this is the, the passion fruit. Let's give it to my wife first. My turn. Open it some sauce. Mm. Very strong passion fruit flavor. Very smooth and silky. Oh, this one's a good choice. I'm gonna try this one. All right. So he said that this one was um. It has matcha. I, I I don't know them all. Sorry. Let's try. So it's actually ice cream in the middle. I don't want to hurt my teeth. It's ice cream in the middle. And then the, and the outside is like a, it's like a chocolate. Not what I was expecting. I was expecting like a, like a mochi inside, but it's actually ice cream. Very good. Very well presentation. Very good. This is the matcha. See, so I'm just gonna break it apart for you, oh, so I can show you the inside while I can. No, it's hard. Yeah. All right, so I was able to, I was able to break it open, so you can see what I was saying. See, so you had the um, the ice cream inside, and then you had a, a chocolate shell on the outside. So that's what you see. So um, what we did was we just took the whole thing and, and put it in in your mouth and let it melt, and that gives you the max flavor. But at least you can see what's on the inside now. All right, guys. Well, that was X Pot. And man, what an experience. So uh, we had the, uh, the full food tour. Um, I have the uh, menu in there. Uh, took a picture of the menu, so uh, I'll make sure to put that in the video. But man, that was an amazing, amazing food adventure per se. And um, I wish everybody would try it when they come to Vegas. So if you do come to Vegas and you want a very good adventure for food, and you like hot pot, come to X-Pot. And I'll see you guys in the next one.